Welcome back to Northwest Elite Spirit, the channel you come to to train your mind, body, and spirit. I'm Coach Brian. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, do that now and make sure to ring that notification bell to stay up to date on all of my newest releases. This is The Fire Within from Encounters with the Nagual, Conversations with Carlos Castaneda by Armando Torres from the chapter The Final Choice. One afternoon, Carlos was limping when he came to a meeting. We asked him what had happened, and he told us that while he was at the hotel, for one fraction of a second, a toe on his left foot lit up and was scorched with an internal fire. I had to move quickly because my assemblage point had begun the process of alignment. Moved by his strange experience, he talked for a long time about the final exercise of sorcerers, by means of which they catch fire from inside and enter pure awareness in their totality, shoes and all. One of the people in the room asked him why, if the passing into awareness is the final objective of sorcerers, he had fought to retain his individual self today instead of taking advantage of the opportunity. With a roguish smile, Carlos told us that the question made him remember one of his ancestors, a Portuguese who devoted himself to the business of transporting people to Brazil with the story of the promised land. The man made a small fortune that way and he did a great job of creating propaganda about the advantages of Brazil, but he had never been there. And here I am, similarly transporting you after we had laughed at his anecdote, Carlos changed the expression on his face. In a very formal tone, he explained that warriors do not act for reasons of self-importance, and therefore their decisions are not theirs. Don Juan told me how some men of knowledge, after a life of impeccable fighting, decide to remain, while others dissolve like a puff of wind into infinity. The thing that makes some warriors fight to retain their self is something unrelated to personal concerns. To belong to a lineage of power implies bonds of such a deep nature that our personality is annulled. It becomes just a minuscule detail in an energy structure that the new seers call the rule. Properly speaking, in that situation, individual choice no longer exists for the warrior. All he or she can do is accept their destiny and fulfill the commands of the rule. Anything else would just lead to his extinction.